All right, now I'd like to talk a little bit about Alter Bridge and three, mm -hmm. um, which is also available on vinyl. It's an import, so you know if you find one, call me because I'd like to get my hands on one. Um, this has been called a concept record, is that right? Uh, we didn't go into it making a concept. I think just because the lyrical content was kind of, um, you know, you, you see it in about six or seven songs, uh, people started calling it a concept record. But it's pretty much about uh, uh, a man's struggle with believing in anything that's not in the material world and, and uh, kind of growing up believing everything's all, you know, life is this nice utopia and, and everything is great. And then you grow up and you see that uh, you might not believe in what people have been teaching you your whole life, you know. and, and uh, you know, Miles especially has a tough time believing in God or anything other than what he can see and touch. See, now I thought, just listening to it a couple of times, um, it was about someone who had lost all faith in his life, just could not find anything good at all, no good qualities in the world. And as it, the album progressed, he was finding it gradually as he went along, but then it seemed at the end he kind of lost it again and kind of descended back down to where he was before. Yeah, you know, it's kind of in a nutshell, it's, it's about, you know, we never want to have an album where it's just pure negativity. There's got to be some kind of light at the end of the tunnel. But um, I think along with the lack of faith and everything else that this person is struggling with, it's also just a loss of that childhood innocence. And, and uh, you know, you just grow up and become a little more jaded and you see what the world is uh, you know, really, really about. So when this tour is over and... Um Miles, uh, is, is he going to go back and record with Slash? I guess Slash mm -hmm, mm -hmm. really would like to record with him again. You, for a while, have had some solo stuff you've been working on, stuff that doesn't work with, or you said maybe not so much with Alger Bridge or not so much with Creed, but stuff that you wanted to, people mm -hmm. to hear. Is that going to continue this year, and is it going to come out this year? Yeah, well, last year, uh, or I'm sorry, last three months, I had off because Miles was touring with Slash, so I, I looked back through all my old ideas and, and saw all the stuff that I might have played with Miles that never made it on a record or never made it on a Creed record and, and uh, took my favorite stuff and just put it together and uh, it'll probably, we'll probably start releasing stuff in January. Excellent. All right, so um, will there be a vinyl edition? The most important question. You know, I don't, I don't <laughs> think so. I don't know. That would be, if, there was success, if we have success with it, yes. All right. All right, cool. Well, thanks for doing the vinyl dump with us. Thank thanks for you. sitting down with Thank us. You. I appreciate it. Mark Tremonti here from Alter Bridge on the vinyl dump, WAF. WAAF.com.